Let's talk a little bit about night one of the convention. Um, what a powerful lineup they had compared to the Republicans. I mean, hmm. uh, Paul Simon sang Bridge Over Troubled Waters. Some suggested he might not do that in the future alone because it was with him and Garfunkel, and Garfunkel was the one who handled the high parts, but it's still very powerful to <laughs> they, see him. They didn't there. have a plagiarized speech, <laughs> though. No, they didn't. No, they didn't. Uh, Eva Longoria, the, the, the famous actress, introduced Senator Cory Booker, who gave a very, very powerful speech, followed by a woman who was defrauded by Trump University. Um, her name was Cheryl Lankford. Her husband died in Iraq, and she was given a settlement from the government, a certain amount of money to, to help. And she took some of that money, if not most of it, and said, well, I'm going to try to advance myself. And she invested in Trump University uh, under the false pretenses. So she gave a very powerful rebuke of that. <coughs> and then um, we had Michelle Obama. And uh, she came out and delivered a powerful in speech. In a non-plagiarized speech. A non-plagiarized speech. Well, <laughs> I, you know, I actually, in the rundown, I actually wrote down, and, and uh, in Melania Trump's uh, next speech, I mean Michelle Obama's speech. <laughs> oh, God. That's the fraudulent slip. Yeah. And then Representative Joseph Kennedy, he introduced uh, Elizabeth Warren and Keith Ellison introduced Bernie Sanders and they all gave very powerful speeches in the moment saying mm. look we need to unite come together and uh, you really if you think about it at the end of the day Michelle Obama is the one who can be credited for saving this convention and she was able to blow Trump out of the water without ever mentioning his name once and uh, we have a clip here which uh, gives you a little bit of what she actually said how we explain that when someone is cruel or acts like a bully, you don't stoop to their level. No, our motto is, when they go low, we go high. <laughs> with, with every word we utter, with every action we take, we know our kids are watching us. We as parents are their most important role models. And let me tell you, Barack and I take that same approach to our jobs as President and First Lady because we know that our words and actions matter, not just to our girls, but to children across this country. So that today, I wake up every morning in a house that was built by slaves. And, and, and I watch my daughters Two beautiful, intelligent black young women playing with their dogs on the White House lawn. And, be and because of Hillary Clinton, my daughters and all our sons and daughters now take for granted that a woman can be President of the United States. There was not a dry eye either in the house mm. or as I watched it on this little tiny iPad here. I mean, it was one of the most powerful things. She is fantastic, actually. Yeah. I mean, what an asset that is for Hillary. And, and, well, Barack in this case and Hillary. Yeah. Terrific. Even more so than Bill, you know, yeah. going forward because she's really, um, you know, stepped forward and done some really yeah. great things there.